let's be honest. When your future is so bright that you gotta wear shades, that brightness just might come in a few different levels. Some days it's maybe partly cloudy, but what if there's a solar eclipse? Luckily, one innovation has got your eyes covered, because a button can aid in bringing the shade. Here's Adam Yamaguchi to explain. The innovation of protective eyewear against blinding sunlight and glare dates back to the 10th century and the Inuit people who inhabited the snow-covered regions of North America. But the familiar look of modern-day sunglasses was developed much later, in the 18th century. Today's lenses are designed to block most UV rays, and the tint or darkness of the lens doesn't change with the variations in light intensity. So there's a lot of taking off and putting back on your cool shades. A company called Ampere has developed a pair of app-enabled smart sunglasses that lets you tweak the tint, take calls, and listen to music with the touch of a finger. I jetted to San Francisco to meet Ampere's CEO, Reed Covington, and learn more about their tech-loaded frames called Dusk. So what is Dusk? Dusk is the world's first pair of app-enabled, electrochromic, smart sunglasses. App-enabled, electrochromic, smart sunglasses. Nailed it. Okay, so what does it all mean? Because it looks to me like a normal pair of sunglasses. There's actually a lot of technology packed into this lightweight pair of shades. What electrochromic lenses means is you can customize the tint level of the shades to the exact tint that you want, except they're using electricity to inject liquid crystals into the film of the lenses themselves. And as a result, they get darker or lighter. There's a film involved? There's a thin layer of film that we need to manually put on each lens of each of the sunglasses. It's actually an extremely intricate and manual process. Now, how is this different from, let's say, traditional sunglasses that will adjust to whatever light is available to them? Those are what some people would call transition lenses or auto-adjust lenses. They transition from a lighter tint to a darker tint based off of the amount of sunlight they're receiving. Now, this sounds great in theory, but there's this constant delay that's happening, and it's kind of a bit disoriented and it looks a bit creepy. So that's where our electrochromic technology comes in. We think it's quite a game changer. Where is the technology hidden? So there's teeny PCBA boards inside each of these frames. If we look closely here, on this side over here, we've got the way to toggle between the light and dark tint. And then over on this side, this is where we've got our built-in microphone, speaker. They're just little speakers, but it's enough when it's resting on your face that you can hear music and take calls and and all that good stuff. And where did you come up with the name Dusk? It's the time of day when the light is going from lighter to darker. Our sunglasses also have the ability to go from lighter to darker. From dawn until dusk. Pick the perfect day. Reed and I went so outside high. to soak up some bright sunshine. Ah, oh, it's gorgeous. And realized we only had one pair of shades. Luckily, one size fits all. So you've got them on the dark mode. And then I hit, hit this button here. Wow. Very good. 